It's a big weekend too at Thruxton Motor Racing Circuit near Andover. The British Touring Car Championship rolls in with a really close battle at the top. Also returning is the entry-level Janetta Junior Championship. And we're about to catch up with a young driver from Fleet in Hampshire who we first met earlier in the season. So let's join Paul Clifton who's in the paddock for us tonight. Paul. David, right down here at the back of the paddock, there is a lot going on. Just look at the state of these tyres. And in here, they are fitting a new engine to the car before tomorrow. That is a huge task. We're getting towards the end of the season now, and a lot of young, fledgling racing drivers' careers are at stake. The junior drivers have been out on track this afternoon, ahead of two races tomorrow and another one on Sunday. And we'll catch up with one of the young drivers in just a moment. 30,000 spectators will be here at Thruxton this weekend to watch Britain's top domestic racing series. And at the front of the touring cars are the BMWs run by one of our local teams, West Surrey Racing. And I've been talking to the drivers who are second and third in the championship, and they're each hoping for their first big title. Yeah, Thrux is an amazing place, you know, I love it. Uh, it's been very good to me the last few years, actually. Uh, since 2019, it's been a great circuit. I've had lots and lots of podiums here. So I think in the last six races I've been here, the lowest I've finished is fourth. So, uh, yeah, very, very good time. And I actually love driving this place. It, it gives a real thrill. These last few race weekends are always really exciting. You're trying to get the last few points to get you towards that championship total. So. It's an exciting weekend. It's a circuit that I really, really enjoy driving around Thruxton. Let's wait and see how it turns out. Earlier this year, we introduced you to 16-year-old Leona Theobald, who's in her first season of racing. And when we met her here last time, she just sat her GCSE exam that morning and then dashed here to be part of the Ginetta Juniors in the afternoon. And now she's back with us again. Um, it's the day after your GCSE results this time. How did they go? Yeah, they went really well. Really pleased with them, especially like with everything going on, it's really good. Now, how's the season gone? I mean, you, you, your car's looking a little bit battered, I have to say. Yeah, so we have had a few new windscreens and bonnets and bumpers, but each round we're just gaining more and more experience, so it's going really well. I love the way you say it, we as a <laughs> racing driver. I mean, it, it's you with a, a supporting team. Yeah. Um, There's a lot what, to it. What happens then next? Do you, do you carry on racing after this year? Yeah, so we will, I will be racing next year. And we're not sure yet what, because there's just so many options. But we're in the process at the moment of looking around. OK, now Thruxton is very, very fast circuit. So what's going to happen this weekend? Who knows? It was a good outcome last time um, when we was here. But this time we have three races compared to the two. So just got to keep clean and see what we can do. Now, Something happened when you were out earlier this afternoon. Uh, yes. Tell me about it. So in one of the test sessions this morning, I did have a little off at 100 miles per an hour at Goodwood, but the car's all fine. It just went onto the grass, so we're ready for the weekend. Um, I mean, and people listen to you saying a little off at 100 miles an hour. How, how does that feel? For me, I find it quite like exciting, as long as you're not in the barrier. And there was loads of grass around, so... It was good. So what's going to happen for the, 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 the last three race weekends of the season? Who knows? I'm looking forward to Silverstone on the next round, but who knows? Anything. OK, well, this is your home circuit, so, Leona, best of luck with this weekend. Thank you. Three races. There's some racing tomorrow afternoon. There's qualifying in the morning, and then the big race day is on Sunday. I think I've missed only two in the last 40 years, and they were both because of COVID, so... I'll definitely be here watching Leona on Sunday. <laughs> Thanks very much indeed, Paul, and of course, good luck to Leona for the weekend.